welcome to my latest video. Now this is officially autumn. Look how dark it is behind me. It's not even that late in the day and it's so dark. So I'm just going to film anyway. So I'm sorry about the lack of interesting stuff behind me, but never mind, we will carry on. So this video is a little haul from Lush and it's all things to do with Halloween, which I'm so excited about. It combines two of my most favourite things, having a bath and relaxing and also Halloween. I absolutely love it. I'm so excited because I just love Lush as a brand. They are just incredible. And so I walk in and I'm like, oh, filled with this aroma of just amazingness and this really so I've got a um, hair on my on my face and this really lovely shop assistant kind of showed me around showed me what they had for Halloween or Halloween related stuff and it's kind of more going into Christmas now but I still managed to find some goodies so let's start off with oh my gosh um, what should I go for first everything is all beautifully wrapped up and labeled as well which I absolutely love so you don't forget what you've got so the first one is this sparkler bath bomb. Now I'm gonna actually open this as well while you guys are with me. So I just don't wanna get stuff everywhere. So this is, oh my gosh, this is incredible. This is like a, a, like a, I don't know how you describe this, like a big sausage. It's like a yellow sausage. And it's just incredible, oh my God. This stuff, okay, so when you put it in your bath, he did a little demonstration. It's just so cool. It fills the whole bath with yellow, but then it's also got like gold glitter in there as well, which kind of fills the bath as well. Oh my gosh, I was in love. I was like, wow. But don't worry, it does not stain you orange and yellow. That would not be a good look. But, oh my gosh, it just smells so beautiful and relaxing. And, oh, I can just imagine like lighting a candle and popping that bad boy in the bath and it's just gonna be like, gonna love it. Then, what else do I have? Oh, this is so exciting. Okay, I have another bath bomb. This is called Lord of Misrule. Mis Misrule? I don't know how you say that one. Sorry if I'm saying it wrong. Um, but this one, oh my gosh, how amazing is this? This is like green and it's got loads of different kind of colours injected in there as well. So when it goes into the bath, Oh, it's going to be like a disco ball. I'm so excited to try this. This is massive as well, so I'm going to get a lot more from this than as opposed to the slightly smaller one. So it depends how much fizz you want in the bath with you. But this one, if I can try and explain how it smells, this one's probably a bit more deep. It's a bit more, those ones are quite like fruity and nice and light and stuff. This one's a bit more deep. Oh, I'm just so excited. Like, I think I actually just licked it then. Oh. It doesn't taste good, it smells good, don't lick it. But again, this one actually has, oh no, I was gonna say, it's, gonna go, it's got a little bit of shimmer to it. Oh, I love this shimmer. They've got like glitter on all of them. This is so cool. I'm gonna come out like a glittery hot mess. It's gonna be great. So that's exciting. I love like adding them to baths. I just think it makes life a bit more interesting when you're just swimming around. It's just, why well, not to swimming, but you're just lying around. It's like, mm. So when you've got something in there, it's a little bit more exciting. So I love bath bombs. They're so good and they smell incredible. Okay, so then I have some soap. This soap is so cool. This is actually called fairy ring soap, but it's like a toadstool. When I saw this, I was like, wow. You can't really get the full idea of it just from this one little bit. But it was honestly, on, this, on the work surface, it was like a toadstool with like a stalk and everything. Oh my gosh, I was so excited. So I've just got a little bit of the top, and this is just like a bar of soap. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at the like circles in it. Oh, I love that. Like, it's just amazing, and oh, it smells nice. It smells really good. I'm not gonna lie, I just went for it because of the aesthetics. I was like, because of how it looked, I was like, that looks so cool but actually it smells really, really nice. So I'm just gonna bath in this, well, I'm gonna rub this on my body and stuff and use it as like hand soap and things like that. So I'm really excited because I actually love this. Who doesn't love a toadstool shaped soap? Oh, incredible. So that's really cool. Um, you can also use these for like ideas, for presents and stuff like that. That's what I kind of don't always go in there and think, oh, I need something for myself. It's always like, mm, you know, like some of these, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna use these all myself. But um, if I was to like them, then I'd maybe go back in and repurchase them for other people, because people love bath bombs. It makes people so happy. Then this is my most favorite one. You guys will absolutely love this. Okay, so this is called the Sparkly Pumpkin. 
Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Wait, let me show you without getting glitter everywhere. Oh my God, look at that. It is actually like a pumpkin. It looks like a pumpkin. It's even got like, I don't know what these little stick bits are in the middle, but it looks like a little pumpkin. And it's so gold and glittery and cool. And I'm really excited to use this, although I think I will get covered in glitter, but it'll be worth it because I will have bathed in pumpkin goodness. I mean, it doesn't smell like pumpkin, which is good, because I'm not sure I'd like to bath in a pumpkin. I don't think it would smell that nice, like the smell of it. I don't think I'd like that. Um, the good news is it doesn't have any seeds in it, so you won't get any of those anywhere. And it's just beautiful and pretty and lovely and girly and, oh, Halloween-y. I love it. And then the final thing, which is just going to look scary rather than be like uh, in the bath and stuff, so I love their face masks, so absolutely I'm in love with them. And this one is called Cupcake, it is incredible. And they're fresh face masks, so you kind of pop them in the fridge for like a week, uh, well I'd say probably like two to three weeks you can get out of them. Just use them like once, twice a week, and oh my gosh, you will love it. Now this is a chocolatey sort of one, and it's prone for, it's, it's more prone for like oily and teenage skin. So if you guys have struggle with your oily skin, then definitely this is a good one for you. But with the winter kind of coming and my skin has been a bit all over the place recently, I do definitely get some oily buildups in like my T-zone, so that's where I'd probably concentrate this on too. But it's just so amazing. It's like got cocoa in here and just, oh. But you can also scare people with this as well. You can pop it all over your face, look horrendous, but have fun as well because you'll smell like a big piece of chocolate. And yeah, you can just scare people at Halloween as well, which I love. I'm just going to open it and try not to get it absolutely everywhere. Oh my God, it looks like, a, it looks like brownie. I just want to eat it. Oh, it actually smells like chocolate. It's so good. I'm, no, that's too good. Oh, I'm going to want to eat my face. That's not, not the best. And I've got glitter everywhere as well now. This is not going to go well. So guys, that is the end of my Lush haul. I'm super excited to use everything in the bath. I'm trying not to going to put, I'm going to try not to put them all in the bath at the same time and create a massive mess. But I'm probably going to come out looking like a sparkly hot mess. If you guys have been to Lush recently or you have some amazing, amazing products, uh, that you want to share with me then please 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 let me know below what are you absolutely loving from Lush at the moment and also if you get any crazy colours going on in your bath take a little photo obviously not of you in it but just take a picture of the bath water and send that to me tell me what is your craziest one that you've ever used which one you're absolutely loving and I'll be sure to try and give them a go please remember to give this video a massive thumbs up for me and of course remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already and I will see you guys in a few days time in my next video bye well, I'm feeling a little bit like I don't really want to stand out loads, but you know, who doesn't love a shiny, massive bow in your face? Like, yeah, I'm here, these are my lips.